Independence County detectives still trying to figure out what happened to James Bushard. Hello, and thank you for joining us tonight for KRK4 News at 10. I'm Caitlin Reardon, in for Hillary Hunt. The 49-year-old's body was found inside of a dumpster earlier this week in Independence County. Four people in Lono County are facing a number of charges, including capital murder. Tonight, KRK4's Rochelle Turner speaking to Bushart's girlfriend. And Rochelle, what did she have to say? Well, Caitlin, good evening to you. Amber Anderson is completely heartbroken. She says she and James were in a relationship for 17 years. She says he was a good person, and it's still hard to believe someone would hurt him. That's us. That's the only one I could find with both of us. Amy Anderson flips through memories she shared with James Bushhart. We dated 17 years. Really, the last few years, we kind of lived here more or less as roommates. She says James was silly and fun to be around. He loved music, and he loved to have a good time. And he was smiling most of the time and, and uh, uh, chatted to himself, you know, and giggly and giggling all the time. And he had a big heart for his three dogs. He loved Lola. First thing when he got paid, he, he bought pet food and pet supplies for the dogs. And it's memories like this that are the only thing left for Anderson. Just a big shock, you know, like, it, like it's not true. Earlier this week, detectives in Independence County found Bushart's body inside a dumpster. Why would someone even do that to, to it? anybody, you know? The investigation led authorities to this Lone Oak County home. That's where deputies connected these four suspects to his death. They're facing a number of charges, including capital murder. It's just not fair. You know, you just think, why? And, and, and why so, so horribly? You know, why, why so violently? Anderson, still with lingering questions, but says James will always have a place in her heart. Just disbelief and shock and awe and kind of like he's still going to come to the door smiling and, and see the dogs and dogs are going to be, you know, excited to see him. Now, these four suspects are also facing charges of abuse, abuse of a corpse, and tampering with physical evidence. They remain at the Lone Oak County Detention Center with no bond pending their first appearance. Anderson says James was going to turn 50 years old later this month. Back to you.